Right now, you are being showered with ancient dust from outer space. Every single year, more than 5,000 tons of it lands on Earth. It's on your house, in the ocean, it's literally everywhere. You've probably breathed it in today. So what is this stuff and what unbelievable secrets is it hiding? The idea that Earth is constantly hit by space stuff is totally real. These tiny particles, smaller than a hair, are called micrometeorites. And get this, they are the biggest source of alien material on our planet. Way more than all the big meteorites combined. So the real question is how? How does this dust survive a fiery plunge through our atmosphere? And what does it mean for us? The story starts in our solar system. This dust comes from comets and asteroids, which are ancient leftovers from when the planets were born. Comets are like giant, dirty snowballs that shoot off a trail of dust as they get close to the sun. Asteroids also make dust when they smash into each other. But scientists believe 80% of all the cosmic dust that hits us comes from a group of comets flung toward us by Jupiter's massive gravity. Once a piece of dust breaks free, it starts a long, spiraling trip toward the sun, pushed by solar winds. As our planet barrels through space, it just vacuums these particles up. Their journey ends in a blaze of glory. When they hit our atmosphere at unbelievable speeds, most burn up as shooting stars. But the tiniest grains survive. They slow down in the upper atmosphere and gently float the rest of the way to the ground. A constant shower connecting us to the universe. So if thousands of tons of this dust land every year, how do you find it? It's like trying to find one specific grain of sand on a beach. To find these tiny needles in a massive haystack, scientists go to the cleanest places on Earth, like Antarctica. There, the cosmic dust falls on clean sheets of ice, and they collect it by melting tons of snow. NASA also sends up airplanes with sticky pads to catch particles in the stratosphere before they ever hit the ground. This is where it gets really crazy. This cosmic dust isn't just space junk. It might be the secret ingredient for life itself. When Earth was young, it didn't have key organic compounds needed to kickstart life. But guess what? Cosmic dust is packed with that material. Many scientists think this constant delivery of dust acted like a fertilizer for the planet, seeding the young Earth with the exact stuff needed for life to begin. This isn't just dust, it might be our oldest ancestor. So the next time you wipe dust off a shelf, think about its incredible journey. It started on a comet, traveled for millions of years, survived a fiery dive through our atmosphere, and ended up in your house. These 5,000 tons of dust are proof that Earth is totally connected to the cosmos, constantly getting deliveries of ancient star stuff. If you thought this journey was insane, then subscribe and hit the notification bell.